to make a person feel bad. Ready, go. It's intended to make a person feel bad. Very good. And this word here, I just want to go over it again. This word is intended. What word? Intended. So we had some people in the last class kind of tripping up on that word or, or changing it altogether. This word is what word, everyone? Intended. Intended. What word, Jose? Intended. Very good. Intended. Next one. Show me that you're ready. Set. Like Rachel's comments about smoking. Ready? Go. Like Rachel's comments about smoking. Point for you. Very good. Now we're going down to the words. First word, track it, is definitely. What word? Definitely. Yes, definitely. This word is embarrassed. What word? Embarrassed. Point for you. Next one, cigarettes. What word? Cigarettes. Point for you. Next one, scenarios. What word? Scenarios. Excellent job. Point for you. Appearance. What word? Appearance. Behavior. What word? Behavior. Ultimately. What word? Ultimately. Very good. Three points for you. Excellent. We are going to now move on to our reading practice, which is, what is our focus, everyone? Accuracy. Accuracy. And Stephanie told us that that means reading correctly, right? Reading the words 100% correctly. Track me. So your job as a coach today is to make sure that your partner is reading the words 100% correctly. Now, are you in your partner's head? No, okay? You can't physically make them say the words correctly, right? So if they make a mistake, it's okay. What do we have to say? Who can tell me? Who can tell me? What do we have to say if our partner does make a mistake? Denise. Very good. And this should happen very quickly, okay? It's not something that we should spend a whole lot of time. Like, it should be, stop, the word is, error. What word? They say the word, go back to the beginning of the sentence. That quick, okay? Um, it's up here in case you forget. What, coach, what do you need to be doing as your partner's reading if you're going to catch their errors, Alma? Tracking. Yes, tracking with a, with a pen or pencil, right? Because we also need to be marking those errors so we can tell our partner what their errors were and be reminded, okay? So now... I need my brave readers to raise their hand. Who's gonna read first in the partner group? Raise your hand if you're a brave reader. I need one, very good, in your partner group. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, and thank you. Coaches, raise your hand. If you didn't just raise your hand for reader, that means you're a coach, okay? That would be you, you're reading. Coach, 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 coach. Awesome, awesome, thank you. Now, flip your paper over, and three, and two, in one, show me that you're ready. Set. Jonathan's gonna put two minutes on the clock for us. As I'm coming around, I'm listening. I'm giving points for error correction. I'm giving points for people following along. Okay? Two minutes on the clock. All right, show me that you're ready. Set, make sure our papers are flat on the table. And first readers, begin. Make sure you're not all reading together. Read as you normally would. Point for Kirkman and Duria, they're tracking as they're reading. Tall and speedy. The next day, Gina is working on a problem in math class. Suddenly, Tyler calls out, Hey, down in the front, we can't see over Gina the giant. Gina blushes and slumps. Down low in her seat, embarrassed. After school, Rachel and Gina walk together. Point for this table. Nice job tracking all of you. Point here. Nice job tracking all of you. Listening for error correction. Correction. They are. Just be listening carefully. 